such damage only happens if you're a germaphobe. Oh, great. That's me. All right. Now, my beep boop's got to deal with a lot of stuff here. He's got to distract a lot of people for me. And luckily, he can't die because I am playing on uh, what is effectively known as baby bitch mode. Non-hardcore mode. I'm still playing on hard difficulty, just not hardcore. Fall damage allergic occurs when you're allergic to gravity. Yeah, that's how that works. Let there be fire, fire, fire. No, come back. I wish to arc my shots at you. I keep missing my lizards. Beep so boop much just for roasted newt. Well, beep boop just killed one. See, I'm on the rocks that they hate, so they run away from me. But oh, there it is, right there. Remember how I said earlier that death claws? There's like different denominations of them. Mhm. Mm oh, that one's not it. Where's my death claw, Alpha Man? Beep boop. What are you doing? Beep boop, no! Beep boop's just. Beep boop's just going. I will help you, beep boop. I will help you, beep boop. I will help you, beep boop. Beep boop is unconscious. No, beep boop. Can beep boop die? No, beep boop can't die unless I'm in hardcore mode. Otherwise, he would permanently die. Okay, good. Thank goodness. But he does not regain consciousness as long as I am in combat. And we will have to remedy this and save Beep Boop. Yes, which means I must kill all the Death Claws. The brave little toaster with a laser gun. I keep giving it Mr. Zircon quotes in my head. Mr. Zircon wishes to kill. See, I am in a safe spot where these things can't hurt me, and I fear going down. But there is a safe rock here. There is a safe rock. It's kind of an odd spot, and we're going to have to deal with it later. Can you, like, gun for it, or is it too far away? It's too far away right now. I wouldn't make it uh, with them hitting me. And it's a very picky rock. But what I can do is I can save. And then what we'll do is we will try and stealth boy our way here. This is why I bought that stealth boy, actually. See, because this game, you could abuse a lot of things with uh, invisible walls. Uh, with the lack of invisible walls inside of Fallout uh, 3. That's why um, they put more invisible walls in this game. Right, gonna... My beep boo came back to life. And they keep attacking him. He's a real trooper. Right, I'm hitting them. I'm hitting them. They are now flaming death claws. Because fire, while it's saying that the shield is doing damage to them, they are actually taking damage over time because fire does seven uh, hit points of damage over time. Okay, so it does typical burner poison damage. Yes. All right, thanks for joining, Redai Fire Cat. I hope you can join in the future for more. I will try to have Aether on as well. Have a good night. Have a good sleepy sleeps. Good night, Redair.
I'm just raining fire from above on this death claw. Fire, 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 fire. Beep Boop keeps coming back to life and then they keep hitting him back down and it makes me cry. We must avenge him. Yes. I keep knocking over my Beep Boop. See, this thing is actually deceptive. Normally, you're not supposed to be able to hit something this far. But because but I'm arching... makes deception for po poison damage and arching. It's because I'm arching the shots. Alright. So, I was wondering why everyone was congregating over there and why I kept saying that uh, Beep Boop was going unconscious. I guess because I'm far enough and I'm hidden, it's treating it as though I'm not in combat and it's reviving him. Ah. Yeah, see, it just revived him right now. Beep Boop, no! Is there any way to call him back? <laughs> not this far away. No, I should not strap dynamite to him. Also because I kind of sold all my dynamite. Besides, he is too precious for that kind of treatment. Exactly. He is he is my he is my little beep poop. Fired. One death claw is about to die. That's right. Come hither. Come hither. Come near. Come and die. Okay, I got one. At least two to go. Oh no, there's a lot more. I haven't even oh. I haven't even gotten to the mother or her babies. Oh. Okay, they're they know I'm here. They're mad at me. But they can't do shit. This guy will stop moving. But he's on fire. Might actually be able to hit him if he gets close enough. Alright, I'm going to use actual bullets here. I need to save my fire stuff for something else. So we're gonna use the varmint rifle. Use the scope. Do I have any armor piercing rounds? That is the question. I do, I have 84. Seems like a few to spare. That actually goes through a lot. Death Claw is just getting annoying. Oh my gosh, they brought Ibo back. Ibo? Yeah, he's a robotic dog from like the 90s. Huh. I can hit his head a few times. But a boom! Bada boom! Why are you not dying? You should be dead. Did 
There we go. That took that one out. See, look, I've already run through 20 bullets. Well. <laughs> Alright. I'm a... Tr they're quite absorbent, aren't they? Yeah, they are very durable. That's the thing about Death Claws. They are highly durable. Alright. I'm gonna be naked. And now that I've actually killed two, I'm actually gonna save again. Believe it or not, I did this at level four on normal mode when I was a kid. The first time I played this game, I was gonna say when I was nice. a kid. I don't know how I managed. Feels like, to we... Do. Feels like we had more talent as children playing these games. Yep. I'm a walk slowly. I'm gonna hate it because my stealth boy is gonna run out like very quickly. My goal is a set of rocks where I can save myself. Hawk. No. There be the rocks That's and really there be the alpha male death claw. Ooh, you might want to sneaky sneak as fast as you can. Sneaky sneaky you know work. It. Sneaky sneaky fail. Sneaky sneaky. <laughs> Dead. Not being surprised. You know what gave me away? What? Beep boop. <gasps> no. He didn't mean it. Spare him. Where's the alpha male? I was... Oh, man. Hey, you don't want to see me in my underwear. I mean... Butts are a part of my job, so... <laughs> I have no reaction. That's fair. Okay, can this thing get on this thing? I think you can, because I think you're trying to run after me right now. Yeah, let's put it this way. Working in any sort of medical field pretty much kills any sense of modesty. Ah. It's just daily occurrence. Alright. This guy is gonna want to kick my butt. Then you're just gonna have to kick his butt first. I don't have enough bullets. Is there a way to improv? Uh, yes. Shoot all the bullets at him. Yeah, I see, look, they see me right now. I think they're gonna try and get up here. Yep, they are trying to get up here. Whoop! I fell to my death. Remember, fall damage is a thing. Yeah, I forgot I was not wearing armor. Because my goal is to get to those rocks. There is a, there is actually a thing, a uh, challenge, where you, if you kill five death claws with your boxing tape or your fists you will unlock that challenge being completed first i thought you were going to tell me there was a challenge for defeating something in your underwear there probably is Right, so I will. Right, I will put on my armor this time so I don't die when I fall. Oh, my beep boop went unconscious again. No, poor beep boop. He tries.
I don't even know what I got caught on. Looks like I'm hanging. <laughs> Foot stuck on the bar. I know. All the siding glitches out. I know. I'm actually kind of laughing at that because I'm like, come on. If I live, I can just fire from the hip from there. <laughs> Who needs two hands for a rifle? I mean, it would be a semi-decent pose if you were actually sitting on the bar, but... Yeah, I know. Whatever this ballerina thing is, because you pulled a hamstring so hard, you died. Not the hammy. Alright. I see you over there, Mr. Deathclaws. I'ma shoot you in the face. Oh, I missed. Shoot you in the back. I got a critical strike. That didn't do anything to it. I need to get over to where by where Beep Boop is. Cause I need I need to get to that rock. If I can get to that rock and not die, then I'll be able to easily destroy everything in this quarry junction. What did you just realize, Teen Shade? The fact that I have done this before when I went to uh, Evergreen Mills? This is just tremors. Yeah, I'm trying to stay on the rock so I don't get deaded. Since apparently one hit kills you. Because these things are so powerful that they can just kill you in one hit. Alright, we're trying that again. I can play the waiting game, Death Claws. Don't you worry. Whoop. I know that he has burrito while he waits. I do, which I have yet to start eating. Come on, Mr. Death Claws. Well, power shall keep me alive. There's the Death Claw Alpha Male. Right over there. There it is. The angriest of fuckers. Zero percent is kill percent. Going for it. Go, 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 go. I'm stuck on a rock. Stuck on a rock. Stuck on a rock. There we go. You can't kill me. I'm too angry to die. <laughs> Never mind. No, you haven't missed much, Verts. We're just stuck in a valley full of giant lizards that can kill us in one hit. Meanwhile, we are trying to save a small robot. Oh, the robot can fend for himself. I'm just trying to survive for myself. Also because I this is like a good two levels right here. Go baby, 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 go 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 go
<laughs> I made it to the fuck you, Rock. Now you all, all fear me. And if I remember correctly, there should be some babies over there. Safe because you made it to the rock. Yes. All right. All right. Now the babies should be over this way. Baby. No, come over here. I wish to kill the babies. Alright. I have two death claws on fire. I don't know where the alpha male is. See, here's the thing, uh, Richard. Uh, death claws ignore the power armor damage threshold that it gives you. That's why it's actually better to fight death claws naked. Is that the alpha male? Is that just a death claw? Yeah, that is the alpha male. Let's take out the alpha male first. Lame, he ran away back to his kids. Too bad there's nothing closer. I mean, I can trigger them to get closer, but that also triggers them to want to attack me. Because... The swarm. Yeah, they will swarm me. That was beep boop just now. <gasps> Look, it's a little baby. Oh, the mother's spawning in. You can see part of her right there. Oh, my. Kill the baby. Kill the babies. Kill the baby. 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 Kill the babies. Look at the little baby. It's actually kind of bad that this thing kind of ran right next to me because now I can kill it and the mother's going to go crazy. Silly little baby. Death claws are mutated lizards that were experimented on. Oh my god! Oh, it broke physics. Fallout physics. That was close. <laughs> <laughs> All the babies are going after me now. He I'm... thinks Rock not safe. He thinks Rock not safe as well. Hope you're a good shot, Nero. Don't worry, I got fire. I got fire. It will carry me on. Oh, you're still alive. Okay. I found baby weak point. <laughs> now, problem is I need to find the other death claws. Oh, the mother's actually gone berserk because of the fact that I killed the babies. So she actually gains a damage uh, boost. Hey, there's the daddy. Hi, daddy. I killed your babies. I was wondering where he went. I hadn't seen him in a while. Just been skulking around, I guess. I found Mama. That's a Mother Deathclaw. She's stuck. She knows I killed her babies.
got to angle this just right. Because if I can kill the mother, then I'm pretty golden. She's just mad because all her babies are dead. This is thing of Emma. This is, yes, this, I, I do not blame her. Yep, that's the problem with the rocks of doom and sadness for death claws. There is a fat man inside of that pool of water there, but that pool of water will get you killed. Alright, we're gonna step down from the rocks, trigger them to come near me, and then hope to god that they don't get the idea to actually walk on the rocks. So we're gonna save again, because I'm, I'm, I'm scared of you little bitch boy. Poor science. Poor science. Poor science. Oh, there's one over there that's just hanging out that just wants me dead. Alright. I'm on a lower plane. Can you see me? You can see me. Haha. -ha. Now you can do nothing because I am on higher rock. I got the mother. I got the mother. She is stuck. Two, one. Hello. Okay, you do have like reloads for that. That's good. I was worried like you have like five shots left. Yeah, the uh, thing right next to it is ammo. Yeah, I just didn't know you had like another ammo pack. So I was kind of worried that was, was going to be your last chance. Oh, no. That because I have such a small gun stat right now and energy weapons, um, that's why it's not doing as much damage as it would be. In fact, the burning effect's the only thing really doing the damage here. Just doing a jaunty little walk. Oh no. She's actually aggroed to the point to where she can actually attack me. Can anything else attack me at this range? As long as she doesn't uh, get out, it should be fine. There we go, that's where I need to aim. Look at her. Stuck. Not being able to do anything. Helpless. The fool. There she goes. Zip zap zippity bopping away. Her model's too big. Because she's getting caught on everything. Oh, when she escapes and you hear me scream, that means I'm dead. See, her first mistake was actually going on to that little area right there. It's basically just a catwalk. Yeah, she's kind of stuck on it because her model's so big. That's why she's popping in and out on things. There she goes! On fire! I wish this was like ants where they would just frenzy and start attacking each other. You can get a pet death claw in Fallout uh, 2. There's also an intelligent death claw. Okay, where did Mama Bear go? There she is. I could actually follow her with 
my varmint rifle, and my armor piercing rounds. She just zooms. Got her. Got her. Got her. As she fades in and out of existence. As I basically do a challenge where I'm not supposed to be doing this until I'm at least like level 20. What level are you currently? I am level 12. Oh, you're really not supposed to be here. Well, I mean, you can go anywhere you want. You can actually go here right at the beginning of the game. You just won't make it far. Boop. Mama Bear is almost dead. Look at that health dwindle. I don't know why she's just standing there. Probably at this point, because she knows if she comes out, she gets lit on fire and becomes a toasted newt. But toasted newts are good. Because she could actually survive that instead of this. And one more shot should do it. Mama Bear started moving again. She finally got unclipped. Mama Bear is dead. Meanwhile, Papa Bear is just here standing on water like evil Jesus. I was going to say, he's stuck too. I've never seen him on the water like that. I will not loot the corpse yet. Keyword is yet. Not until we know they're gone, because the moment you step off that rock, they come for you. They Everybody come. Everybody unglitches and guns for you. Yep. And boop. Do not give me a dollar to kill myself out for all this progress I've made. Give me 20. I'm actually surprised he's stuck on the water. Should be my last five shots. Four. Five. Yep. I am out of shots in that. And I got the Alpha Claw. Alpha Claw. Alpha Death Claw Male down to half his health. Why do I have mostly melee weapons on me when I am not a melee build? Hi, Papa. Hi, Papa. There he goes. Zoom, zoom, zoom. As he just stares at me from that rock. Set Papa Bear on fire. Zoom? I don't remember that show. What channel was it on?
I am almost out of all the bullets I need. Apparently it was from 1972, according to Google. Huh. Yeah, definitely before my time. PBS. Ah. So new, I do not remember it. Apparently there's a remake. Created almost entirely by children. Oh gosh, it's not like what Cartoon Network tried to do for a while, is it? Or is it Nickelodeon? Excuse me, Nickelodeon. No, you're thinking of Cartoon Network, see Unreal. Didn't Nick have one too, though? Like, people were getting so mad that it would interrupt, like, actual shows yes. in between to show, like, these YouTube skits? Yes. Because they weren't good. No, and it's kind of invasive anyway. Like, I'm here for a specific show. I'm not here to watch random 10-year-olds make a YouTube channel on television. Remember when the Annoying Orange and Fred got their own television shows? Yeah, I do. Okay, Mr. Alpha Male, you're almost dead too. That's what I want. Yeah, it was real. It just didn't do too well. Oh no, I'm down to... I am very low on ammo. And there are still like 30 death claws. Oh. Oh yeah, if it thinks you're on the kids algorithm, it's gonna like really push kid stuff. It's insane. And then what gets through the kids' algorithm is weird because YouTube doesn't police its own site. Oh, yeah, just stuff on there is bizarre. Like, even the regular stuff that's supposed to be there is just bizarre. It's like I'm watching Nightmare Fuel. Yep. It's like the kind of stuff our generation used to make fun of for being horrible is now, like, the mainstream on kids' YouTube. But no, I mean, like, if it thinks you clicked on, like, one kid's video, like, I was listening to the, um, Chocobo Dungeon soundtrack because it's awesome. And, uh, my entire recommendations was, like, little kid toys and little kid videos and nursery rhymes. And I'm like, what the heck happened here? One video. Last three shots, gotta make them count. Last shot. Come on, 8% headshot. 8% headshot, you failed me. So what now? Machete? I could. If I wanna die. Uh, I wish I had, I wish I could use my plasma rifle. That would actually be really great. Seeing that alpha male just go. He is a good, like, one shot from dying. Got him. And he fell in the water. Oh, no. All that work, and he went in the pool. He went in the sploosh. He went in the green sploosh. Hello, Mr. Deathclaw. Do you wish to tango? Because I will tango. I freaking love that. He's like, 
Oh, n I the moment I pulled out the f incinerator, he's like, nope, not dealing with that. I recognize what slayed my mother. And my father. It is my family's curse, my legacy. What a horrible night to have a curse. Uh, I should have come in with more flame or fuel. Alright. Oh my god, that did absolutely nothing to it. Do I have any interest in the Castlevania titles? I don't mind them. I'm just bad at them like most games that are 2D. Because 2D games and me, we just don't mix. Alright. Just because I want to give myself an out in case this entire thing has been a waste of time. Separate save. But classic Castlevania offers so many strange roasted chickens in the walls. I love my wall turkey. Special brick roast flavor. I love my wall turkeys. They were coming after me. See, look, I'm not on the right rock. I get on the right rock. I'm not on the right rock. Right, there's three, four. How did I hit you? This is a shotgun. Pure luck. I hit him again. That shotgun has some range. I know. I need something to kill them. Should have put the scope on the 9mm pistol. Okay, yeah, buddy. One. Two, three, four. All right, all of them have grouped back together. So now... Well, all but one have grouped back together. I hide behind the rock like a coward. I know this is boring, folks, but I want to clear out Quarry Junction, and I'm a stubborn man. We're kind of stuck anyway. Nah, I have an out. I can. I have an uh, save that I could completely ignore it. I meant from your point on the rock, because if you get off, you die. This is true. Well, I have a stealth boy to give me an out as well. Yeah, that worked really good last time. Well, that was because the Deathclaw Alpha Males decided, I'ma kill ya. Look at all them Deathclaws. You do not see me. 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 Beep boop. 
Beep boop. Beep boop. Beep hey, boop. Hey, he's back. You're and screwed. Yeah, I am. Because he lured two of them near me. Oh. Fudge. Ugh. Stabbed in the back. <laughs> I didn't see that the thing had proctored to being something other than caution. All right. Will you give me an out to fast travel? I must know. Oh my God, I can fast travel out of here. I will be back. You have not seen the last of Neuronium. Hi, Beep Boop. Sorry about putting you through all that, buddy. Welcome back, Beep Boop. You need something? I killed the Deathclaw mother and the Deathclaw alpha male. I come from anyone else, I'd say they were drunk or crazy. But that look in your eyes, I believe you. I can pay you, but it ain't much for what you pulled off. I'll get on the ham radio first thing and tell people all about you, though. That was all I needed to do. I got five 100 NCR dollars. Because all I really needed to do was kill the alpha male and the mother. And then it would count as the mission being completed. I just wanted to kill everyone else because there's another um, quest that's tied in there. We shall come back later. We shall finish the job. Welcome, sir. Or Venditron, show me what you have for sale. You have different parts today. But not what I'm looking for. Nothing that I'm looking for, actually. Except for the hunting rifle scope. I will take that because I've I've come to realize I need that. You have 308 rounds. You don't have 308 rounds. This is actually bad. What's going to suck is I'm going to miss out on those Deathclaw hands and eggs that I could sell. Actually, yeah, I will. Yeah, because wouldn't they technically be strong enough to be turned into weapons themselves? Uh, in Fallout 3, there was a weapon called the Deathclaw Gauntlet where you can end up uh, fastening together a Deathclaw hand onto a medical brace. Basically a really butchered version of the Wolverine Claws. Yep. And it ignores... Uh, in this game, there is one, because it's oddly not a craftable weapon in this game, but you can do it inside of uh, the DLC Lonesome Road with a special death claw called Rawr. R-A-W-R. -R. Rawr. Oh, that means he loves you. I know. It means he loves you in Deathclaw. Yeah, he really loves you because he wants to eat your flesh. How is that even a thing? All right, so what I need to do now is I need to go over to here because over here there is a thing for a side quest we can end up doing but I'm gonna have to actually mess with my companions in a bit in order to be able to do it because unfortunately you can only have two companions at a time and one of them is Boone right now the other one is my little beep boop beep boop has to wait at home does he D? yeah beep boop's gonna have to wait at home Right. We're going to get a Van Graaf Thug, and we're going to grab his plasma armor and rifles. And then Caravan 1, get your lower action shotgun. There should be another Van Graaf around here. Van Graaf. Right. And now I can repair all the plasma rifles. There we go. Now I got a plasma rifle. This is good. There's one more caravan place that we have to find. 
And then I can do that side quest for that character and then never have to use them again. Which is a shame because I actually like that character a little bit, but eh, oh well, it is what it is. Sacrifices must be made. Especially because there's a lot of really good characters in this game. Two amazing ones, uh, some super awesome ones, and then two that are I'm kind of middling on. Boone actually being one of them, which is a shame because Boone is really good. Whenever he sees a Legionnaire, he kind of goes the beep boop route and they must instantly die. Which brings me to another question. Can human companions die? Nope. It is... Oh, darn. I forgot that I'm still signed in on my main account. Hello, random person. <laughs> it's my coworker. He's probably going to be watching Netflix with his family. I should be by the YCS86, actually. So I could use that to actually take out the death claws. Yes, Richard, worst streamer. That is definitely what I am. Because I just wasted everyone's time taking out two death claws that I could technically take out later. But it's also a stream, not a let's play, meaning it doesn't have to be, well, streamlined, ironically enough. Very true. And my New Vegas playthrough is anything but streamlined. This is Cl St. Clair's house. Where is the thing for the YCS-86? It should be up north on the map. I gotta watch out that I don't get killed. Because it's a very powerful weapon. It's the most powerful energy weapon in the game. Yeah, Apescape, ironically enough, is the only thing that's streamlined. Hmm. I don't see where the YCS-86 people are. So we're going to go and deal with some wind brahmin. Because they should be right around here. Because if you choose the wild wasteland park, this is where aliens would spawn. And you can kill the aliens for their weapons. Oh goody, nuclear fallout wasn't enough. We also get aliens. Well the aliens, there was an entire DLC in uh, Fallout 3. That was the worst DLC I handled in that game. So are the aliens actual aliens, or are they mutants? No, they're actual aliens. They were abducting people for centuries. You had a person from before the war when... Uh, one thing that I didn't tell you about the Fallout universe, uh, Canada no longer exists. What got, the heck happened to Canada? U.S. forcefully annexed it. Eh. I turned them into goop. Yeah, Canada was forcefully annexed by the U.S. because uh, China invaded Anchorage, Alaska, and we had to save all those resources, I guess. And Canada was like, no, we're not going to let you go through our country to go and save your one state that you purchased through very questionable means in the past. So the U.S. responded, okay, fine, we annex Canada. So it is annexed as in all the people are dead or like canada itself is just a wasteland uh we and like we forcefully took over the country and made it okay. part of the u.s look at the puppers be the first time nope would not oh no no more free health care Right. There's more of New Vegas over there, but we are just going over this way to get ourselves. Uh, 
Also, don't forget to eat something. You don't want your burrito getting food poisoning. Yeah, you are right. I, I should eat. Food is indeed good. And while it is still good and not detrimental to health. This is very good. This is very true. Especially because it is a breakfast burrito. Oh, yes. Okay, this person's head went bye-bye. Darn chem junkie fiends. You give me your laser rifle. And give me all your stuff. You don't need it. You're dead. Wait. And... Where is the incinerator? Alright, I will take bite of burrito right now. Good. I will listen to the healthcare worker. For she knows the importance of food. And eating it before it goes bad. Delicious burrito. Ah, there it is. The Patriot's Cookbook. Wait, no. That's just a skill magazine. Oh, yeah. I should also mention for the Fallout universe, pretty much um, it went full-on propaganda mode and conspiracy theory nut. There's actually I mean, a... That kind of tends to happen when your whole civilization goes boom. Well, no. This was pre-going boom. Oh, pre-going boom. Do tell. Um, they would, uh, like, install, like, secure, they would basically, like, just destroy the Constitution and place it under the fact, oh, we're just protecting you, don't worry. Rights to privacy were violated, you would be killed if you were seen as a sympathizer for, uh, because in Fallout Universe, it's China versus the U.S., That was bad. That was also bad. That was also really bad. <laughs> oh. Rip. I ragdolled three times. Oh, it's just a scratch. Mm-hmm. It is a flesh wound. It's a good thing I saved. <laughs> 